हाई एंड अ वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग गुड अपना ध्यान रखो आई एम गुलाब साई योर मेंटोर एंड आई वेलकम यू वंस अगेन टू अनादर सेशन ऑफ आर बी आई टू फोर सेवन वेर बाय ऑन अ रेगुलर बेसिस वी डिस्कस सरन सर्टन करंट फाइनेंशियल हैपनिंग्स अराउंड अस सो वॉट डू वी हैव फॉर टूडे सो टूडे वी आर गन डिस्कस थ्री इंपॉर्टेंट न्यूज आर्टिकल द फर्स्ट इट टॉक्स अबाउट द अप्रूवल that the insurance regulator IRDAI has given and it has given an approval to a portal what is the name of the portal the portal name is bima sugam portal to iske bare mein discuss karenge secondly we'll talk about india's declining forex reserves however apart from discussing this we'll also talk about and look around the surroundings that is is india the only country that is facing the problem of forex reserve decline or what is the scenario for our neighboring countries and world at large and thirdly we'll be talking about the meeting of the monetary policy committee so an additional meeting has been scheduled for the next month so why is this meeting going to happen because abhi to time hai nahi right the next meeting was scheduled to happen in the month of december so why are we having in the month of november iske bare mein discuss karenge in today's very video one more request from all of you if uh, there is a problem with my voice do bear with me because i i wasn't well for the past few days but let yes let's get started with the very first news that is I, irdai's approval for bima sugam portal so this portal has received the approval of irdai and from january 1 2023 it is going to go live ये पोर्टल क्या है इट इज एन अम्ब्रेला पोर्टल दैट इज गोइंग टू प्रोवाइड यू ऑल द फैसिलिटीज रिलेटेड टू द इंश्योरेंस सेक्टर बी इट परचेजिंग एनी इंश्योरेंस प्रीमियम और सेलिंग द इंश्योरेंस प्रीमियम फॉर द सेलर्स पर्सपेक्टिव अगर सेलर्स को बेचना है वो बेच सकते हैं इफ यू आर ए बायर यू कैन परचेज एनी इंश्योरेंस पॉलिसी अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू रिन्यू योर पॉलिसी यू कैन डू दैट if you want to claim if you want to take a claim on the policy that you have taken all of these features will be provided to you at one place we can understand this by thinking of a supermarket agar aap mall mein jaate ho supermarket mein jaate ho you get all the facilities aapko sabzi lene hai aapko kapde lene hai if you want to purchase jeans if you want to purchase accessories all of these facilities are provided at one place so this Bima Sugam portal is going to be a one stop destination an umbrella kind of thing whereby all of your insurance needs as i have talked about buying insurance or if you want to change if you want to port from one premium one premium policy to another that you can do you can change your insurance agents aapke jo agents hai ya brokers hai unko change kar sakte ho and you can, you can even settle up your claims so this is the utility of the bima sugam portal to isko approval recently irdi ki taraf se mil gayi hai and in terms of irdi's chairman irdi ke chairman ne kya kaha hai it is like a upi thing jaise upi brought revolutionary in the digital system this bima sugam is going to is going to bring a revolution in the insurance sector kyunki sari cheeze aapko ek jagah pe milengi that to at a digital space and all of these facilities will be provided and this will help in having more of financial inclusion in the country as you all know financial inclusion is not only of having a bank account apart from bank account you should also have an insurance account insurance policy hone chahiye you should have pension account as well so this will help in penetration of insurance policies across population in the country i hope iski utility aapko samajh aa gayi ho if we talk about yahan pe kya hoga so it is going to be an online thing and here all the policy holders will be getting an e insurance account aapke paas ek online e insurance account hoga wherein you can view all the products you can select your products you can make claim on that product and even you can file a claim or settle your claim theek hai now who all are going to be the facilitator kon facilitate karega if agar hum physical mode ki baat kare to wahan pe banks hote hain 
राइट इवन ऑनलाइन स्पेस में वी हैव पॉलिसी बाजार काइंड ऑफ थिंग हेयर ऑल ऑफ दीज पार्टिसिपेंट्स विल बी द फैसिलिटेटर हु विल फैसिलिटेट द बायर्स और द पॉलिसी होल्डर्स टू परचेज और टू सेटल एनी काइंड ऑफ इंश्योरेंस नीड्स यूजिंग दिस बीमा सुगम पोर्टल वेब एप्लीकेटर्स लाइक पॉलिसी बाजार पॉलिसी एक्स ब्रोकर सच एज बजाज कैपिटल प्रोबस इंश्योरेंस ये सारे एग्जाम्पल्स हैं आपके इवन बैंक एंड इंश्योरेंस एजेंट्स ब्रोकर्स ऑल ऑफ देम विल बी फैसिलिटेटर्स इन सेलिंग द इंश्योरेंस पॉलिसीज तो ये सारे जुड़ जाएंगे एंड दे आर गोइंग टू बी दी सेलर्स हेयर तो आपको एक बेनिफिट बहुत क्लियरली विजिबल होगा तो बेनिफिट इज यू गेट अ वाइड चॉइस ऑफ प्रोडक्ट्स एंड सर्विसेज तो आपको बहुत सारे चॉइसेस मिल जाएंगे देर विल बी कंपटीशन अमंग देम सो यू विल बी गेटिंग अ कॉम्पिटेटिव प्राइस तो आपको बहुत अच्छी प्राइस मिलेगी इन ऑर्डर टू परचेज एनी ऑफ द इंश्योरेंस पॉलिसी ऑफ योर नीड आई होप दिस इज क्लियर टू यू सिंपल है समझ आ गया हो नाउ दी idea should be to understand not to like just to have just to memorize the thing but to have an understanding and just to memorize the important thing what is the important thing the name of the portal the name of the platform rest all should be understood so that even if questions are asked based on based on this if statement based questions are asked then you are in a position to answer all of them अब देखते हैं वो ऑल आर गोइंग टू बी द मेजर स्टेक होल्डर्स एज वी ऑल नो बैंक होंगे इसमें राइट बैंक होंगे आपके ब्रोकर्स होंगे अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट आपके लाइफ इंश्योरेंस होगा जनरल इंश्योरेंस होगा सो यहाँ पे एक चीज बहुत क्लियरली आपको पता होना चाहिए दैट दिस बीमा सुगम पोर्टल इज गोइंग टू प्रोवाइड नॉट ओनली लाइफ इंश्योरेंस पॉलिसीज बट अपार्ट फ्रॉम लाइफ इंश्योरेंस लाइफ इंश्योरेंस के साथ आपको जनरल इंश्योरेंस भी मिलेगी वट डज जनरल इंश्योरेंस इंक्लूड्स जनरल इंश्योरेंस सच एज अगर आपको कार इंश्योरेंस लेनी है या फिर आपको मोटर इंश्योरेंस लेनी है या फिर आपको हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस लेनी है राइट right? medical health insurance all of this will be made available to you through this bima sugam portal agar statement based question aata hai that bima sugam portal is available only for life insurance that will be wrong and that is also evident from the major stakeholders agar hum stakeholders ki baat kare inki percentage di hui hai that the life insurance council jitne bhi life insurers honge unki 30% weightage hai then we have the general insurance council having 30% weightage then we have the public sector banks all the online public sector banks having a weightage of 35% and brokers association having a weightage of 5% I hope this is clear to you. Next is the benefit जो आपको अब तक समझ आ गया होगा The first benefit जो यहाँ पे है that is you are going to get a centralized space. आपको एक centralized space मिल जाएगी where all the products and services across the insurance sector is available to you at one stop place, at one stop destination. That is the Bima Sugam portal or the platform. ठीक है And it is also going to assist the buyer in If the buyer is facing any challenges, जैसे मैंने बताया अगर आपको पोर्ट करना इफ यू वॉन्ट टू चेंज योर एजेंट दैट ऑल्सो यू कैन डू सो यूजिंग दिस एप सो एनी चैलेंजेस दैट आर ब्रोक दैट दैट आर पॉलिसी इंश्योर पॉलिसी इंश्योर्ड और बायर फेस देन ही कैन चेंज और पोर्ट देयर रिस्पेक्टिव पॉलिसीज बेस्ड ऑन द कवरेज एंड प्राइसिंग तो जो भी उनकी पॉलिसी प्रीमियम वो पे कर रहे हैं और जितना कवरेज उनको चाहिए बेस्ड ऑन दैट यू कैन डू सो फॉर एग्जांपल यू हैव टेकन अ कवरेज ऑफ फिफ्टी लैक्स और उसके अकॉर्डिंगली आप कुछ प्रीमियम पे कर रहे हो ना हो यू आर फेसिंग अ चैलेंज एंड यू फील कि मेरा जो ये है फिफ्टी लैक्स इज टू मच फॉर मी शायद मुझे इतनी की जरूरत ना पड़े और या फिर वाइस वर्सा इफ यू थिंक फिफ्टी लैक्स इज टू लेस फॉर मी आई वॉन्ट अ कवरेज ऑफ अराउंड नाइनटी लैक्स इन दैट केस यू कैन पोर्ट योर प्रीमियम यू कैन पोर्ट योर पॉलिसी अकॉर्डिंगली आपके जो प्रीमियम पेमेंट होंगे वो भी चेंज हो जाएगा राइट दिस इज क्लियर टू यू नेक्स्ट इट सीज सेम वाइट चॉइसिस फॉर द बायस टू पिक बहुत सारे जितनी भी इंश्योर होंगे ऑल विल बी लिस्टिंग दियर प्रोडक्ट्स तो आपको कंपेयर करने का मिल जाएगा Amazon पे भी जब आप मोबाइल फोन लेने जाते हो यू कंपेयर राइट 
इस मोबाइल की स्पेसिफिकेशन को उठाते हो दूसरे मोबाइल दूसरे ब्रांड के मोबाइल की स्पेसिफिकेशन को उठाते हो एंड देन यू कंपेयर इन ऑर्डर टू फाइंड अ प्रोडक्ट फॉर योर सेल्फ दैट बेस्ट सूट्स योर नीड सिमिलरली यू विल गेट अ वाइड रेंज ऑफ इंश्योरेंस प्रोडक्ट्स व्हिच यू कैन कंपेयर एंड देन फाइंड आउट द बेस्ट सूटेड फॉर योर अकॉर्डिंग टू योर नीड्स अकॉर्डिंग टू योर बजट एंड अकॉर्डिंग टू व्हाट एवर रिक्वायरमेंट यू हैव एंड थर्ड इट सेज दैट द प्लेटफार्म विल रिड्यूस कमीशन सो all of the commissions that was paid to the brokers or to one person will be reduced obviously because of competition itna competition hoga ki sab apne jo commission hai usko reduce karenge thereby you can select the best suitable product at an appropriate premium price to aapko ye sari facilities benefits mil jayenge using the bima sugam portal and this will help this is going to help in the penetration of insurance products across the population of the country i hope this is clear to you <coughs> now let's move forward and so this is just a gist of whatever we have talked about one more thing aapko jo bhi insurance policies milengi that will be provided to you directly or through assisted board aapko aapko koi wahan pe hoga online assistance ke liye or directly you can do so right all of these will be provided ekyc bhi hoga aapka through your aadhar number and this is going to be launched from next year january 1st right now let's talk about the second news which says that india's forex reserve has declined and the amount by which it has declined is 3.8 billion dollars so rbi ne data nikala tha jisme india ki jo forex reserves hai it has been declining and it has declined to 524.5 i hope this is visible to you 524.5 hua hai and this is the lowest since july 2020 2020 ke july se lekar ab tak this is the lowest and the major reason as we all know is because of rbi's intervention rbi intervene karta hai forex market mein so because of the intervention by rbi in the forex market there has been a decline in the forex reserve and the major decline which has been seen is in the foreign currency assets so as you all know there are four components of the forex reserves hamara jo forex reserves hai iski char component hai we have talked about this bahut bari baat kiye hain humne video mein bhi even in the weekly current affairs now one of the part is foreign currency assets which is the largest component isme hi decline dekhne ko mili hai i hope this is clear to you very simple factual yet now there are certain other charts which says that india is not the only country to have seen a decline in its forex reserves apart from india if you talk about our neighboring countries neighboring countries such as vietnam vietnam ka example lo ya fir bangladesh ka lo you can see that their forex reserves has been a major decline Bangladesh ka 21 so there has been a decline of around 21% so kafi zyada decline hai however if we talk about the brics country agar inme dekha jaye then india has the highest decline that is around 12.6% so india ki sabse zyada decline dekhne ko mil rahi hai that is around 12.6% This is just the graph that I'm trying to explain you, right? The third it says that the rupee has depreciated around 11%. So this is an important data to be kept in mind. कि रुपी हमारे depreciate हुई है. Apart from that, forex reserves भी हमारे गिरे हैं. But one thing that should be kept in mind is that rupee has depreciated against the dollar. हम यहाँ पे जो भी comparison कर रहे हैं, all the comparison that we are doing here is between rupee and dollar so against this dollar our rupee has been depreciating no doubt about it but if we compare our rupee with other currencies then in that case our rupee has been stronger it has been appreciating so this graph shows ki shows that in january 2021 last year our rupee was around 74 a dollar around 74.26 and now if we talk about october then at the end of october like yesterday it was 82.5 so rupee has been depreciating and the rate at which it has been depreciating is 11% which is again very huge next 
the next talks about whatever we have talked about which says that rupee is the not is not the only currency to have been depreciated if we talk about chinese renminbi chinese renminbi ki case mein aap dekh lo 13.4% se depreciate hui hai our rupee has depreciated just by 11.1% similarly japanese yen aap dekh sakte ho right which so this currencies are part of sdr as well IMF की जो एस डी आर है स्पेशल ड्रॉइंग राइट उसकी भी पार्ट है जस्ट अ सेकेंड सो एज यू कैन सी दैट जैपनीज यन हमारा जो बांग्लादेश का है एंड चाइनीज वेनमिन बी ऑल ऑफ दीज हैज बिन डेप्रिशिएटेड बाई अ ह्यूज नंबर हाई एवर ऑन दी अदर साइड रूपी हैज डेप्रिशिएटेड बट एट अ लोअर लेवल एज कंपेयर टू जैपनीज यन एंड चाइनीज Renmin B. On the other hand, if we talk about the Brazilian real, then this currency has appreciated, actually appreciated against the US dollar. अगर ये सारा depreciation दिखा रहे हैं, then this shows your appreciation. So minus six point five, six point nine percent is the rate of appreciation of the Brazilian real, right? Now the next news that we are going to talk about is the additional meeting of the Monetary Policy Committee. So why are we having this additional meeting of the Monetary Policy Committee? For the simple reason that the provision of Section 45 ZN of the RBI Act 1934 and Regulation 7. So ये दो आपके लिए बहुत important हो जाते हैं. You need to remember this. आगे के slides में I'll show you what this. um what this provision talks about what does it states so according to these regulation these provision of section 45 zn of the rbi act and regulation 7 of the rbi monetary policy committee and monetary policy process regulation 2016 an additional meeting is scheduled and the date of the meeting is november 3 2022 so november 3 2022 ko schedule kiya ja raha hai and this is for the very first time first time hua hai after the implementation of the targeted inflation framework that such kind of additional meeting is getting is being getting held theek hai तो जब हमने 2016 में so it was in the year 2016 that we targeted inflation uh, framework was adopted and based on that it is for the first time that we are going to have this additional meeting why why are we having that kyu aisa hua for the very first time it is happening because as you all know that the monetary policy committee has failed to maintain the consumer price index based inflation hamara jo inflation target tha that was 226% right 4% plus or minus 2% this was the band and we have failed to maintain this band of inflation for three consecutive quarters starting from january january to september nine months and we are not able to achieve this 2 to 6% band of inflation and this is the reason why the mpc is holding its meeting theek hai so additional meeting isliye kiya ja raha hai and this are the this, uh, this is what the provision states if we talk about the first section that is section 45 zn of the rbi act it states that if rbi that is the monetary policy committee fails to meet its mandated target of inflation that is 2 to 6% then in that case the mpc the mpc if mpc fail ho gaya inflation target ko meet karne ke liye then in that case rbi is going to write a report why did it fail and what all measures can be taken in order to come back and maintain that 2 to 6% level of inflation so yahi wohi ye cheez likha hua hai if rbi fails monetary policy committee fails to meet the inflation target it has to write a report to the government explaining the reasons reasons batayega for its failure so the intent or the purpose of this meeting is to tell us to write a report is to provide you with the data with the reasoning why the mpc has failed to maintain the targeted inflation right and this report is to be submitted to the government 
And apart from that, in the report, the RBI will also have to mention the remedial actions. What all sets of uh, procedures and actions will be taken by RBI so that whatever failed inflation target that they have faced, such does not happen. And using these remedial actions, you be remedial actions will be by using that, they are able to achieve and maintain the target of 2 to 6%. So this is what section 45 ZN of the RBI Act talks about. The next is regulation 7 of the RBI Monetary Policy Committee and Monetary Policy Process Regulations 2016. So this read kiya jata hai. Now regulation 7 says that if a separate meeting is required to be scheduled, if RBI or the Monetary Policy Committee fails to meet its inflation target for three consecutive quarters. If it fails for consecutive quarter, ke liye fail karta hai, then it has to held a separate meeting. And this is the process and this is the reason why the, this additional meeting is being scheduled and a draft report is to be sent to the government. Now one point, one very small point here to be noted is that the inflation target is to be maintained or is talked about by the Monetary Policy Committee. But the report, why the Monetary Policy Committee has failed to maintain the inflation target is to be given by RBI. So, jo MPC, jo MPC kya karti hai? inflation target manati hai and tries to achieve this target. But if it fails for the three consecutive quarters, then RBI is going to write a report to the government. So, this point dhyan rakhna and this is all that we wanted to discuss with you. And here are the questions for you. Simple questions. The first question says, which of the following portal was launched by IRDI to provide one-stop destination for all insurance need? Konsa hai? We have discussed. You need to answer it. Agar aapne nahi padha hoga, it will be very difficult for you to answer from this option, right? Now you need to answer it in the comment section. The second question similarly says that which of the following regulations? So you should be very clear ki kaun sa regulation tha. Was it regulation 5, regulation 7 or 9 which states that a separate meeting needs to be scheduled if the monetary policy committee fails to maintain the inflation target for three consecutive quarters. And the third question talks about which of the following section of the RBI Act 1934 states that if MPC fails to meet the inflation target, it will have to submit a report to the government stating why it failed and how what remedial actions should be taken in order to achieve the target. So section aapko clear hona chahiye, right? And answers are provided here. In case of any doubt, you can always ask in the comment section. And keep learning, keep studying. Ask your doubts on the discussion forum or on the or over here or over the Telegram group. We are all here to help you and start your preparation for RBI Grade B exam. Up time nahi hai. Let's start. And this was all that I wanted to discuss with you. I hope you enjoyed the session. In case if you have any feedback, you can write it down. Till then, keep learning and bye-bye.